Hi Capricorn, this is your reading for the 31st of August till the 6th of September 2020. And if you've, you're new and you've just found this channel, then welcome to the channel and I hope you enjoy the readings. Please subscribe and hit the bell on all, then you'll be notified. And for all the faithful and loyal followers, the Cyber Angels, um, Please refresh the button now and again on notifications in the bell uh, on all because some of you are not getting notified. I've just found this out by accident. So refresh the bell on all on all your favorite channels that you are subscribed to. This is your reading, my darlings, for the 31st to the 6th, like I said. And we are in Virgo, so it is a gentler, slower energy and it's steady it's also an energy that what seeds you plant you will and will nurture will come to fruition steady but slowly first of all on the 31st we have the knight of pentacles and he's a very practical man he is delivering news to you this could be about anything uh, that has durability and is for long term like i said if you've sown seeds then you will get news on how they are doing. Perhaps you've um, been to a job interview and you will be receiving news on how you did. So perhaps you might be getting that job that you went for um, and it is a steady job and it will be for long term. Or you could be meeting a Virgo, a Capricorn or a Taurus. Or you might meet up with a friend that is one of these signs if you haven't seen them for a long time and to clarify that card you have the eight of pentacles you've been working hard as the eight of pentacles means that you have recognition and you might even start a new study now i see quite a lot of things in these cards because they're quite mystical and fairy tale like they take you to a different land, the land of fairies and gnomes and gargoyles. <laughs> and, that, and that's why they are so mystical. Okay, besides the normal um, uh, meaning, uh, I see a lot in this. It's like a, a female um, Mother Earth. It's a tree, really, and it is the tree, could be the tree of life but something is growing. You might have planted some seeds, like I said, or you might have planted yourself somewhere because you feel sensitive and safe there. You can be sensitive, you can be yourself. You can your, let your inner feminine side come out and look at the rainbow behind it. It looks, it's a bit shaped like the angel's wings. So the angels are with you and protecting you. This card might give you the feeling of safety, safety to start a new study, or that you are certain of yourself, like you've rooted yourself. That's why you feel complete, and that's why you might be beaming like the rainbow behind it. And you might be being noticed because of that, just because you are you, Capricorn. Now, that is your sign. Capricorn earthly okay so I hope you enjoy the cards then you have the lady which is the Empress Mother Earth so it seems that your week is going to be a nurturing week you might be nurturing something or somebody might be nurturing you that's coming in now the lady the Empress also represents Libra we've got Virgo here and Libra there so Perhaps these two months will be significant. If it's not going to happen now, you might hear news that you will be starting your uh, job um, in Libra. So from the 21st of September onwards. She also means that uh, for she, uh, the time is fertile now to get pregnant or to start something new. Something that will grow with you or that you can make grow you might hear of a birth or find out that you're pregnant as she is mother earth and she is holding it looks like 
uh, an atlas, but I think she's holding her tummy um, as that represents pregnancy. So you might hear th that you're pregnant, or you might hear of an other kind of birth that somebody else is e expecting, and or a new project, a new job, a new house, something, a new beginning, definitely. It could be with an earth sign or with an air sign, Libra. Okay, and the card to clarify this is the Six of Water. So somebody might be coming back from the past. And they might be bringing you a gift. And in this picture, you see Moscow, really, the towers of Moscow. So, um, yeah, and it's in the sea, and the gathering pearls, the gathering treasure. So you might be thinking about your childhood or something in the past where you were gathering goodies and sharing it with somebody, the good memories. So that could be happening as well, that somebody could come back from the past and you might start something together, a relationship or a business. And it could be with a Libra or an Earth sign. Beautiful. These two cards, th uh, this is Earth and this is Water. Six of Cups. So it could also be a water sign. Then on Friday we have Ten of Pentacles. Like I said, you've started something and perhaps you have already invested in something. And it is growing nicely and it's coming to fruition perhaps at the end of the week or at the weekend. You've got the Ten of Pentacles, that means happy families, perhaps a reunion with family members or friends, somebody coming back from the past, celebrating. This causes for a celebration, because it's always nice to s see family members or friends that you love and that you're passionate about. But money is coming in. The Ten of Pentacles could be also an inheritance, a gift. Like I said on Wednesday, somebody's coming back and giving you a gift. This could be a gift of money. This could be a gift of passion. But I think it will be something material. And you could be quite traditional about go going about celebrating the uh, event. Okay. And the card to describe this is the Nine of Water. There is a wish coming true, or a goal. Perhaps you've set up business, in, in invested in a business, and um, you did this on your own and you're getting news about it. You might have applied for a loan to start up your own shop or buy a new computer so you can do work from home. Um, as in the COVID, more and more people are working from home and this is what you have invested in and somebody from the past has noticed this and is coming back and might be giving you a helping hand or a gift towards this to get your website right or to help you um, to get the shop up and running or your restaurant or anything like that it might be a gift like a picture or an offer of a helping hand financially but your wish is coming true and you're going to make steady money because you've got the um, Ten of Pentacles. You are investing and that investment will return and return and return as you nurture your baby. This is not a real baby. This is the baby like uh, material things like uh, your job, your career and you're putting in and you've got recognition because you've got the Eight of Pentacles and you might be getting more com customers or you might be getting more requests but you could all because you could be uh, meeting an earth sign you could be getting more offers of love because you're recognized and your wish is coming true okay the Nine of Cups It's a beautiful card. Look at somebody reaching out to 
somebody else in this case it's a young one and reaching out to its mother but I read more into the cards somebody could be reaching out from the past and wanting to be your partner either in business or in love there will be celebrations as you have the four of wands this could also be that you are getting married or invited to a wedding but there could be celebrations of anything harmony is here definitely with reunion with family and friends awesome you might even move home or buy a new home or rent a new home as the four of wands represents the four corners of the house awesome beautiful then the card that clarifies that card is the page of fire so the page of fire is somebody young that's bringing in news younger than you usually it's a teenager but as they say but I say it could be anybody because time and age is man made it could be a younger person than you that's bringing you news action is job creativeness is the hobby so it could be about that or about a new passion you might be getting news from your new uh, lover or partner Ooh, passion is here at the weekend there's definitely celebrations and you, you are passionate about something so you're celebrating your passion lovely then you have the eight of water you want new beginnings you're fed up with the old routine you want adventure you want excitement but it is coming to you your wish is becoming fulfilled you are totally in balance you're moving on from a nine this is an ending a new beginning and you're moving on again an ending and a new beginning you're going upwards and onwards so believe in yourself trust yourself that this new beginning is here and it, if it's not here this week it will be it's close definitely close don't give up now and don't throw an old pair of shoes away before you get a new pair you can have your castle your castle is where your heart is where your home is where you make your home home is your castle that's what they say in England but it's where you make it so let your open your heart open your solar plex open your mind to new ideas so that you can feel at home wherever you are remember you are the home to your soul so be happy and take your little home that's your body with you wherever you go and realize that you can make your home anywhere you feel safe and sound by the looks of it you are, do feel safe and sound because this is to me that you've sprouted roots because you feel safe and comfortable don't let anybody tell you otherwise now we've got from the Avalonian deck that's a beautiful deck look at you you're moving up uh, upwards and forwards you've got recognition you are being seen you are being seen like a goddess whether you're a man or a woman she's moving forwards okay now this is the moon of dedication moon of dedication moon nine so the moon nine means that do not permit yourself to be discouraged from pursuing your dreams by the words or deeds of others who tell you they are impossible or impractical oftentimes they are speaking with the voice of their own, unreali own unrealized potential perseverance and hard work pave the road to accomplishment and that is what you're doing like I said you start off with the eight of coins you're getting recognized you're moving up from eight nine ten to new beginnings beautiful you're going to receive news and to take action and it will be steady growth there is also a new beginning 
this could be in a partnership with a pentacle sign or um, uh, an air sign Libra um, and there's no other persons in there but of course it can also be with a water sign or fire as that is in your reading as well so have perseverance and courage be straightforward focus on what you want poise ask for what you need relinquish control so let it go whatever anybody says just follow listen to what somebody has to say and but you don't need to follow their advice think about it yourself you're the one that has to stand in your own strength and realize what you want so that your wishes and your goals can come true I hope you've enjoyed this reading darlings and take care I'm sorry about last week but my computer crashed I was uh, a week and a half without a computer that's why I couldn't go live as well but I'm back so I'll see you on Friday Monday, Wednesday and Friday again, take care have a scrumptious week and please share and like thank you